even as the first day of autumn hovers over American shores, traces of summer linger. So every year at this time, nearly half a million people step forward to help, to volunteer in an international coastal cleanup, and the results can be staggering. In the last couple of years alone, an average of eight million pounds of trash is collected worldwide. Please watch where you put your feet, watch what you grab with your hands. We have found in the past hypodermic needles. We've found drug paraphernalia. From California to New Jersey, and here along the banks of the Potomac River just outside Washington, D.C., people don protective gear and comb the coast for trash. 35 glass bottles. And we need extra bags. Right. From cigarette butts to candy wrappers, every little item is recorded by the Ocean Conservancy, the sponsor of the cleanup since it started in 1986. Because a lot of our trash that's found, unfortunately, is not coming off of ships in the dark of night. It's coming from land you know, areas, people who were at the beaches, people who were inland, and things are washing downstream. It's disgusting. All this is out here. I was so shocked. When I came out here, I thought, oh, you know, people don't litter that much. You see stuff on the side of the road, but when you come out here, it's just everywhere. Yeah, it is pretty amazing, actually. We can pick a lot of it up one day, and then the, the next day, come back, and there's, there's twice as much as there was the day before. So it seems like there's no end to the, the trash. At this site, 2,000 pounds of trash were collected in just an hour and a half. Despite their obvious progress, in many places, such as here along the Potomac River, the work is far from over. The river is going to require continued um, uh, maintained efforts for, for many generations to come, but we're getting there. This is a sign that the next generation is going to care about the resource and is gonna to wanna to pass it on uh, to the next generation uh, improved. Everywhere water meets land, the goal of this cleanup is the same to beautify and restore coastlines, and to get people to think about how they dispose of their own garbage so autumn's wind will blow cold, but perhaps not so cluttered.